An immigrant mother living in Massachusetts has finally been reunited with her son after weeks apart. She took her battle to get her son back to the courts. Their reunion comes ahead of a major immigration rally in Boston this weekend. WBZ's Michelle Fisher has more. Right now on Facebook, almost 4,000 people say they plan to attend Saturday's rally. Marchers will start at City Hall Plaza and end here on the Boston Common, fighting against border separation. I feel, think that people are really feel called to action right now. Handmade signs like these are all ready to go for Saturday's rally. It's the event that Lily Wong and her colleagues at Jobs with Justice have spent the last week organizing. I feel excited that everyone is ready to stand up to say that families belong together no matter who they call family or where they call home. Wong and the expected marchers are fighting for people like Lydia Saza and her son Diogo. The mother-son pair was separated back in May when she crossed the border. Her nine-year-old son was sent to a detention center in Chicago. But Thursday, a federal judge ordered Diogo to be released. It was a happy reunion. <laughs> well, when I got there, he already knew that I was taking him home. I said, who, who, who told you? And he goes, I woke up this morning and I had a feeling. Attorneys for Lydia and her son say that right now there are no definitive travel plans, but say that the pair could return to Massachusetts together sometime within the next few days. Reporting in Boston, Michelle Fisher, WBZ News.